Hell yeah. All right, guys, good morning. Welcome to the new video. Don't worry about the beeping sign. It's just my car. We have a pretty interesting day ahead of us. As you saw, I did my cardio first time with a new treadmill, actually fire. So I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, the only problem, I didn't have time to eat my first meal, but at the same time, it's not even a problem because we're gonna be, it's pretty early still. So we're gonna be get back home around 11.30. Sometimes I do eat around 11, so today is gonna be probably the latest, but with that said, it's probably gonna be easier to eat throughout the whole day because calories are pretty low. But heading to a announcing photo shoot for a new company that I've been, that I'm gonna be working with. So we're pretty much filming the kind of a real me and Cheesy's brother, Sam, uh, the announcing that we are with the company, right? So I'm going there, I'm gonna bring you with me behind the scenes a little bit. I'm actually going to Young LA headquarters. Uh, because it's pretty much connected and then later on we have a uh, our subscriber potential new vid videographer coming today so uh today was supposed to be a rest day but if he comes i will film for you guys shoulder day so that's the plan right now i'm driving so i don't want to talk too much we'll see how it's gonna go if i can film anything behind the scenes if not I'm All right, my phone is talking something. All right, guys, I apologize for interruption of this video, but I just wanted to let you know that from yesterday, from the April 10, 12 p.m. PST, Yangale has a huge sale, 25% off on everything on the website, plus a huge restock. That's only happened once in a year for a Black Friday for Yangale, but this time, because of hitting 1.5 million, on Instagram account, this is the biggest sale besides the Black Friday of the year. It's gonna last 72 hours, so when you watch this video, you still have 48 hours to buy something. I will highly recommend not to miss this opportunity because it's, as I said, the highest discount besides the Black Friday. You can use code Dorian, gives you 25% off on everything on the website, plus restock, Young LA for her, Young LA, whatever you want, any item, 25% off with code Dorian. Love you guys, appreciate you. Back to the video. Joseph. Morning. Long time no see. What are we doing today? A regimen shoot. Dorian's coming to the Reggie team. There, now he Finally. Came now he said, yeah, he just didn't say so far. So like, now oh, you announced said, it right now? Yeah, this announcement. Yeah, so now it's going to be a lot easier for him to uh, be part of the shoots, you know, nice and close. Team's all and here. This guy works for them as well. Yeah, Shoot all the young LA guys on the team, you know. It's, Easier. Cool. And, and they have cool shit. Yeah, they have a cool shit. Yeah, show them. Yeah, every day I'm wearing this shit, man. This too, right? Yeah. They yeah, you are chain. wearing all the time. That's true. Oh, he's got You have yours line, don't you? Oh, well, yeah, the lightning bolt. Yeah. Sold out. LT is like sold out shit. <laughs> you can't use it right now. There's the owner right there. Anyways, this is like a. This right here is Young LA HQ. And I live three minutes right now away. And this is the regiment uh, warehouse, pretty much. So, long story short, that's why we pretty much started working with them because we are so close and we're gonna be able to like shoot all the time and, and, and be closer and everything. Kelsey also works here, so it's, it's way easier. So, we're now gonna have that announcement video. Now we know I'm gonna put on the screen right now the regiment website, pretty much, so you know what it is. It's a jewelry company uh, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna talk when I come home a little bit more why I kind of swapped and everything, but uh, for now we're gonna film the BTS and uh, just go Dorian, baby. Nice collection. Um, I don't know why black is crazy. Oh yeah, that one, that one's nice. That's nice. But black on black might be too much. Yeah. Um, we can do... You choose first, man. I don't, I don't, to be honest, we're gonna vary it anyway, so I don't mind, whatever. Can try this first? Yeah, I like that one. Look at this. It's clean. Hey, what's your code, bro? Regiment code. Called, uh, I gotta think of something. <laughs> something special for this. I don't know yet. <laughs> I don't know either, bro. Yeah. <laughs> We'll figure out we post it. I'll post both of our codes on the screen. I have this one. I love good. <laughs> I'm crazy. <laughs> what do they have here, bro? <laughs> I, I mean, I mean, 12 should fit. I'll show yours. What did you get? I don't know, this. 
This actually, it looks like uh, that fence, bro. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but the rest is sold out, so they and had to... This cool. The stack, yeah. 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 Regiment time, baby. <laughs> we go out tonight, bro. <laughs> this is a, a, a life-size cutout of him. That's fucking sick. <laughs> Wait, why do they have this shit here? It's probably bro? fucking this tall. Hey, Obama, bro. Stand over. My point of view. <laughs> Is this good right here? Does it look too, like, fucking forced? I actually like this lighting, yeah. <laughs> now I see it in my it's camera really, also. It's really perfect. <laughs> no, we shot a couple ads here and they look really nice. Right here? Yeah. Right. And quiet rolling. Ready? Good. Action. What are you doing? Oh, hey. You didn't hear? Wait. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm good. I thought, I thought, I thought you good. wanted to zoom in on yeah, us first. It's a quick pause. It's like, hey, and then it's zoom to regiment box. Dorian, send. Three, two, one. Action. What are you doing? Oh, hey. You didn't hear? <laughs> yeah. Good, we're done. A little more pause. Hold out right now. Go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> good shot. That's an icon, the regiment icon. Bro, we can make that a regiment thing. Because now this yeah. is like the. B roll's done. Now it's gonna like overlay clips. Now we are kind of serious, huh? Yeah. Sam, you start off. What's going on, guys? Sam here. I'm with Dorian. We're here to announce we are now with Regiment. Glad to be here. Glad for the opportunity. Happy to be here with Dorian. I made the times. Crew. Great first shoot. Love it. Love the vibes. <laughs> and uh, happy to see where this goes. <laughs> he said everything. <laughs> What's going on, guys? Sam here with my great friend Dorian. Happy to announce that we are now a part of Team Regiment. Look at it. I mean, it's crisp, it's clean. Drip on the drip on the wrist. You know how we do it. Love the vibes here. First, you went great. Uh, just a lot of fun so far, man. <laughs> Don't you agree, Dorian? <laughs> Couldn't agree more. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're just happy to be here. I mean, the, the, the products are great. Look how drippy I am. I mean, you can't make this stuff up. <laughs> you, got nothing on this. you got nothing on my back, but that's all right, because it's on my wrist, where I keep it. So, love to be here. Thank you for the opportunity. Love all of you. And uh, looking forward to future cool stuff going on. So, yeah. Love you guys. Excited for your journey. <laughs> <laughs> The regiment team. Oh. <laughs> it's just, I'm just. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> no. Never ever shoot a load of net. You a rich. I'm a fan. That's why I got a block, you got a tent. Okay guys, we are back. Just ate my breakfast, which was also, by the way, 12 p.m. when I ate my breakfast, so definitely running late. And I needed to make myself another coffee, pretty much, just because I froze my ass there. Today in LA, it started to be really cold, and on the day we were shooting in a warehouse, and I was shooting, as you saw, <clears throat> in a t-shirt. That was actually really fun. And that's why I uh, actually transferred kind of to a new company because of that kind of environment. We are all friends. Uh, it's pretty much sister brother company with a uh, young LA. What are you doing? Oh, hey. You didn't hear?
What's going on guys? Sam here with my great friend Dorian. We're happy to announce we are now with the regiment team. Oh, great products, exciting stuff coming in the future. It's just, I'm just... <laughs> It's been too many takes, sorry. I don't know what to say. At this I'm point. just excited. It's stuff. Great jewelry, jewelry, clean. You can wear it on a daily basis. You can wear it go out. Exciting stuff coming in the future. Cool drops coming. More drip. We can't wait to show you. And uh, happy to see where this goes. I agree. <laughs> <laughs> that is going to be, I don't know when you're going to watch this video, but that is going to be a collab post announced. Long story short, if you follow my channel, I was with Jackson. Jackson is the number one man jewelry company in the world based on Forbes. They're even on the Forbes list, right? Uh, there is absolutely no hard feeling. Shout out Bear, shout out Jackson, I love Jackson. Uh, only thing that uh, right now Jackson is kind of transferring more to a podcast. He does podcasts with UFC fighters, etc. And Jackson house where I shoot is three hour drive away from me. This regiment is two minute drive from me. And the uh, environment that I'm in, it's actually more my kind of team uh, and that's the only reason why I changed. There is not a lot going on in Jackson right now as far as concerned that things. So I decided to make this leap and uh, start with the regiment right now. Also really cool brand, really cool brand as I said. Uh, upcoming brand jewelry is fire, jewelry is really uh, high quality. I just took one box uh, to show you. I don't even know what is inside. Let's see. Oh yeah, this is the, the black necklace. Really nice one. Oh, this one is actually really nice. Yeah. I don't own a lot of black jewelry, so. And then you saw everything. You saw there, I still have it on my wrist right here. There's just some things that I took today, as you can see. Those, then I have a rings. And then I have a two chains, this bigger one, and a cross one. I always wear a cross one. Yeah, pretty, pretty cool stuff. I believe it's gonna be a cold door and as every other firm that I'm working with. Uh, and uh, I don't know how much discount you get from that, but uh, that's a new sponsor right now, Jewelry. I love Jewelry. Uh, potentially in the future we're gonna have collab with them also, so that's also exciting. And as I came home, I received, while well, I'm already talking to you guys, of course, per usual, ghost package. And I believe, I believe I know what it is, which is absolutely crazy. Guys, Ghost just changed the game. I don't know if you saw it on Instagram or somewhere, but Ghost just came with the Believe it or not, cereal. Ghost just came, look at this. With the cereal, that is crazy. Unfortunately, your boy's on the prep, so I can't give you a taste test. So macros are per 41 grams, five grams of fat, 15 grams of uh, carbs only, and 17 grams of a protein. That's actually crazy. Those are actually really good macros for a cereal. Really, really good macros. And then I believe this is gonna be my favorite. I'm a huge peanut butter lover, so this is like a Reese's, uh, Reese's cereal, Reese's Puffs. This kind even has a more protein. In 40 grams, it has a little bit more fat, seven grams of fat, only 11 grams of carbs, and 18 grams of protein. So this is absolute fire. I believe you can order this. It's gonna be April 11th is coming out. I believe you can order these. Okay. Megafit just came, the best meal prep company ever. Don't ever mention other companies, please. Not to. There is Megafit, then million places are empty, and then maybe some second firm that I don't even know. I'm gonna unpack this and prepare my pre workout meal, which is in this box. I feel like, however you turn, there is something in the kitchen working every single clip that I'm filming. Because I'm always cooking, I'm always preparing the food, I'm always eating the food, whatever. So kind of you can hear the uh, air fryer. We are having potatoes in the air fryer. We have a Megafit 93.7 beef and we have asparagus to prepare. So I'm gonna eat my pre-recall meal. Then we're gonna have a to, uh, head to the gym. But a little bit change of plans. Today was supposed to be my rest day. As I was telling or I'm um, just mentioning first time, one person that follows me, it's one of my subscribers for a long time, uh, watches my YouTube videos, comments on my YouTube videos, approached me in the sense that he lives pretty close to here and he would like to get more into videography and he would like to film for me. Pretty much practice and learn by filming for me and editing for me. Obviously when someone watches your channel for a long time, they already have insights how you do 
types of videos and they also like your YouTube channel so that's already meaningful a lot because they want to see you successful because they love your YouTube channel so today was supposed to be, actually yesterday was supposed to be the day that we meet I was really busy yesterday so I postponed it for today and that's why instead of a rest day that I'm supposed to have today I, did, I wanted to film for you guys with him a uh, full shoulder workout because I've been getting a lot of uh, questions to film my shoulder workout and stuff like that I rarely do film that but unfortunately he just texted me as I was planning to film and tell you that guys news you're going to have to forgive me brother I'm so sorry won't, won't be able to make it it is what it is you know I, I uh, everyone's busy everyone's got a lot of things to do and he offered to come by itself so it's not a problem at all he's definitely gonna be coming in the next upcoming videos and I'm excited to see test him out how that's gonna look like maybe we're finally gonna have someone that can be with us all the time that I don't have to pick up the camera and film every single thing so I'm excited for that and since plan changed I can't just leave this video on just pretty much announcing my new sponsor but uh, even though it's my rest day I'm gonna go just for this video and for you guys to the gym and uh, film a shoulder workout which I don't have a just a shoulder workout I'm currently doing shoulders two times per week together with the chest two times per week with the chest so today I'm just gonna be doing probably uh, just a shoulder routine to share with that film that and to have a more things in the video and obviously show the exercises that I'm doing to develop my shoulders all right guys you know what time it is daily dose of caffeine time in all kinds of ways and forms okay this is gonna be an interesting concoction I was thinking this a lot in this big one you already know the drill ghost aminos ghost hydration during the workout and now we're gonna prepare our pre-workout concoction I will start with the legend all out teenage moon and ninja turtles they didn't drink that for a while has 400 milligrams of caffeine guys but I will not full, put the full scoop I will put around 300 milligrams because I don't want it too much and I'm gonna add something extra inside so this around 300 mix but 100 mix is slow releasing or not 100 but almost 100 then we have a gamer also Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles I don't know what flavor is this to be honest because they are like different orange blue you see like Donatello whatever their names are there is a 75 milligrams of a caffeine in a gamer I kind of do need my power of will to go to the gym right now, especially knowing it's a rest day. It's pretty low and I would like to do a mic up, video, mic up video so I can talk for you guys. So you know, I'm trying to get my nootropics going, which this product is. Uh, scoop of creatine, plain creatine, so not to add any uh, flavor inside because we already have flavors. Now, you know the drill peach pump. Peach is one of my favorite flavors when it comes to like product supplements and like that. Not in the real life, but when it comes to supplements, definitely. So we're gonna have a scoop of a peach pump. And then again, just not to mix so many flavors, I'm gonna have a scoop of a normal pump, which is nitric oxide, gonna give us a nice rounded delts during the workout, bro, I missed everything. So, I like to mix shit because then I try and I'm like, oh, this sucks, or I was just, it's like, oh, this is a new thing that I'm gonna be drinking every single day. So let's see what it is, right? There's no in between, pretty much. This is one of those. One of the, I'm gonna drink this every single day. I don't know what flavors are those, but with the peach one, bro, you better subscribe because I'm only gonna be going to the gym right now to hit the shoulders because of you guys there is no other reason so i can show you a full shoulder workout so i'll catch you in the gym okay though guys first exercise so today it's not gonna be my typical chest day or oh, sorry shoulder day first and foremost definitely gonna show you the exercise but probably not gonna be a lot of set today and also i will start with something i don't usually start but i will do this even if i didn't film just because on like rest days or in the mornings i like to hit more like accessory work so we're gonna start first with a smith machine
Okay, as far as concerns, sets, reps, etc. When it comes to shoulders, guys, destroying them. Drop sets, super sets, uh, more sets than you usually do in any muscle group. Shoulders are one of the muscle groups, like the calves, that you use all the time. So if you really want to grow the shoulders, and I get a lot of questions how I did in the past, in every exercise, every workout that I was doing, I will do on the side lateral raises, with every, even on the leg days. That's how I kind of groom myself. If you obviously don't want to do that, I don't recommend to do that. Then focus on a, more sets, more reps, super set, drop set, stuff like that. So I'm gonna stick here for a couple of sets, uh, just to warm up and up to the next exercise. We have a next exercise right now. Uh, it's gonna be a, I'm gonna actually explain you this one. So this machine is obviously for a lateral raises, right? I do it in a kind of different way. Uh, firstly, I do one, I do single arm, just to properly warm up my shoulders. And secondly, I don't do it like this. I put my, I put the bar on top of my head, on the wrist, pretty much. Yo! <laughs> and then I pretty much push like this. So the difference is like, this kind of more like a movement of a pulling up, and this kind of more like a push. I actually injured my arm, arm wrestling, so that's the reason I started doing like this, because it gets more tension on a, on a pronator muscle, but it also helps me more to keep the tension on my shoulders. Just try it out, switch it up a little bit, try it out and let me know. But uh, here, probably like five to six sets, each set, like 20 reps each shoulder. It's gonna be something like that. Okay, that was actually 21 reps each arm. Now, progressive each set is gonna go higher, but we're still gonna keep it around 20 reps. There's gonna be a lot of sets and reps overall, like five sets, each shoulder 20, then of the heavier movements. I forgot to mention, guys, on this machine, while I'm doing actually those other raises, I usually, 99% of the time, superset, just so I don't wait in between. So superset with the front raises, which you can do also in this machine. So pretty much like this. And pretty much front lateral raise. So I was actually doing that by the by didn't film it, so it's gonna be one of the front raises. As I will do, probably gonna be one or two more, one, one, probably one more today. But yeah, super sedate, or you don't have to super sedate, you can just finish first lateral raises and then go into the, the front raise. This one, pretty simple, of course. So we kind of engaged already um, side lateral day, uh, side delts, uh, front delts. And now before I go into a, kind of like, as I said, heavier movements, such as dumbbell press or a military overhead barbell press, I want to kind of balance out each uh, head of a shoulder to like have more like stability, prevent the injuries, etc. So real delts in any sort of way, shape or form, I usually do uh, on a back day as well, kind of whole back posterior chain uh, on a back day. But um, today, since I'm showing you shoulders, I'm doing show that as well. So I want to warm up my real delts and then jump into the probably barbell overhead press. Okay, here I'm not gonna be too long. Probably just four sets, up to 15 reps each and up to the next one. Warm up properly. Well, I actually had a really good part of the session already, but let me adjust the camera. Now we are on the uh, main axis pretty much. 
it's gonna be a barbell overhead press. So people usually like to do a dumbbell press, right? Uh, and I do also as well, 100%. Even though my favorite is definitely barbell, just because I have a better mind-muscle connection when it comes to single movement like this and overhead and I also feel way more my actual side delts uh, than with the dumbbells but I also second favorite exercise dumbbell moves since I'm injured we're probably gonna skip that today or maybe I will try but um, usually it's both it's a barbell overhead press and then I go into the dumbbell with a lighter weight so in this case we are gonna go on the main part of the workout it's gonna be a barbell overhead press nothing crazy with the weight uh, this is I don't even know how much, 25 pounds per each side. Might go up to one plate from each side, which is already pretty heavy. But since I'm six weeks out, probably not gonna go too high. Instead of going higher and preventing the injury, I'm probably gonna go, probably gonna do here six to eight sets, most likely. Like it's gonna be a lot of sets and reps. So uh, I'd rather do that, as I already said, to develop your shoulders is just back to back, all supersets, drop sets, etc. So I'm gonna be here for a while and then we're gonna see what we're gonna do. We still have probably one at least access for a front delt, a real delt, and obviously some more access for a side delts as well. So we're gonna try to keep it in that range. Pretty much six sets to eight, and we'll see you next one. That actually killed me, and I'm not taking my hoodie off today. Besides the barbell overhead press, second favorite movement is obviously dumbbell. But since that movement is really just, like, it's not even a movement, it's me throwing the dumbbells up that kills my arm, which is still injured. But thankfully, in this gym, we do have a this. Um, shoulder press which is pretty much the same as a dumbbell press and you can choose normal grip or neutral but since this one has neutral I'm gonna use a neutral grip in this case two blades let's see how many reps you're gonna do and then I'll tell you how many sets on this one that barbell overhead press this wasn't bad at all 12 reps so on this one probably today we're gonna keep on four to five sets today and then off the next exercise so gonna finish here show you the next exercise all right guys back on this machine uh, we're gonna do the shrugs right now uh, I usually do traps mostly actually on my uh, back day but since I'm showing you today Full shoulder routine, why not to show excess that I actually use over time? So, try this couple of sets till failure. Sets when it comes to shoulders so I'm gonna go probably up to two plates stay there for a while do a last set drop set then off to the 
off to the next exercise. This one's really interesting and I really like this exercise. I actually saw this one from Honey Rambot working out with Chris Bumstead. Obviously, they have a tactics when it comes to sets, reps, uh, half, half reps, etc. But I like to do this super set. Now, it looks like really sus because it's really lightweight, but trust me, 20 pound dumbbell is already heavy weight on this, especially if you want to do uh, more reps and stuff like that. So, I superset pretty much front delts with the real delts. Once again, to hit both heads double, like two times in this workout. So pretty much laying down, chest. Head shouldn't be down, head should be pretty much looking forward. And now, both arms straight as much as you can and lift. So I keep it like 15 to 20 reps with the 15 pound dumbbells and it literally kills me. I'm telling you, just try this one out. That was 15 on also. Also this exercise, you gotta feel the, the traps as well a little bit. But just to focus on my muscle connection, like I can go 20 pounds here at least. But if you wanna do more reps and actually feel the time and tension, don't go too heavy, up to 20 pounds, trust me. First couple of reps, you're gonna feel really light. After the 10th rep, you gotta feel it really. So now, super set into the real delts. This is called Y raise, like Ypsilon raise, right? Why? Because your chest is again up and you're not going on the side, you're going in front of your head and straight, arms are straight. So like this, like Y direction. <clears throat> Oh my god, I'm telling you, even though this looks really silly, if this exercise doesn't kill you, just try and comment below after, after you try. At least 15 reps, 15 reps, literally exhausting because you're fighting the gravity. It's very difficult just to extend your arms above your head and literally here is like your arms already drop so just extending with down the dumbbells it's already weight you're fighting gravity right adding on top of that dumbbells in your hands it's crazy so this supersets i'm gonna do around four sets back to back so four sets of a front row sets of a real delts and then most likely i'm gonna have only one more exercise left which obviously i'm gonna show you right after this this is kind of funny but Start finally went off on the last exercise. Shoulders are pretty pumped right now, if you can see, but last exercise is gonna be, obviously, what else? Then the side lateral raises, but I like to crush side lateral raises. So with that said, we're gonna have five sets of a side lateral raises, starting from 30s. Then we're gonna hold probably 25s, 20s, 15s and 10s, so drop sets each set, so five sets of a drop set back to back as much as we can. And that's gonna wrap up the whole workout. And that's how we're gonna, my friends and family, get a big 3D shoulders. Yeah. Those 12 reps with the 30s, instantly to 25s. Kind of 12 also. 
things are starting heating up after the 20 pound dumbbells. Ah. 12. I don't know how, but pretty much we're keeping everything at 12 right now. Off to the 15 pound dumbbells. This is probably gonna be the last one. I'm not gonna do 10s. And then just pretty much partials, like this, as much as you can. Physique look kind of naughty right now. But uh, that's the last exercise. This is only first set, so I'm gonna do four more sets of this. And I'm probably gonna, since I'm already here in the gym, I'm gonna show you a current physique update being, when you watch this video a little bit less than six weeks out and current weight, is around 205 pounds so all right guys i kind of finished just this just on time well kind of not yet because we need to still finish it but i have five percent left getting pretty close i actually got a solid pump right now this is first with a shirt i honestly feel like we are at least three to four pounds bigger than the last time not think about we were comparing me and my coach six weeks out last time and six weeks now. I was leaner last time, but I'm way fuller and bigger now. So I'm almost like five pounds heavier than last time. Let's see how we look right now. I definitely feel like this is gonna be my best physique so far. Okay, wait a second. I have a lot of chains, you know. Regiment called Dorian. Oh yeah, I love this physique right now. I love this physique. This is, this is right where I want to be. Not shredded yet, but we still have almost six weeks to dial this. I'm really happy with the physique, in all honesty. I mean... <laughs> That's how it kind of looks. My battery is gonna die, guys. Shoulders are pumped. Uh, I don't do always the same shoulder workout. I try to shock my delts pretty much often. That's why they're so rounded and nice and juicy. Um, so I promise you to give you a more shoulder workouts. This one was instead of a rest day. So I kind of didn't want to actually dig in because I'm already tired and exhausted. So we'll, uh, we'll give you more. Give me some ideas. Put the comments down below. As you can see, I'm um, right now uploading pretty often. I'm trying to like figure out uh, as much as possible content days in a life full day of eatings workout so put a comment down below what checks you want to see and I'm gonna try to film that I'm purely focused right now on providing the content uh, you know focus on a prep and everything and uh, you know that's pretty much 
it's all. Comment down below. This is gonna be a wrap, current physique. Thank you guys for watching. I love you and appreciate you all. And I'll see you very soon as always, two days maybe, on the next one. Peace out. Mm.